Using Excel, you created a summary list of your company's orders. Now you want to print it. Since you are going to file a hard copy in a three ring binder, you want to set the document's margins to make sure there is sufficient room for the holes. In this learning module, you will find out how to set margins in an Excel document. Before printing an Excel worksheet, you can preview its pages to get an impression of how the printed document would look. To access the preview, go first to the File tab. Then click Print. In preparation for printing, you can make a number of settings here. The print preview appears at the right. You can use the arrow buttons to leaf through the document, checking page by page to see what the final printout would look like. While checking the preview, you notice that the left margin is too narrow to accommodate binder holes. You therefore want to adjust the left margin. In this area, you can set the margins individually. If you like, you can select one of the predefined margin settings. The currently selected setting appears on a yellow background. To set the margins individually, click Custom Margins. The Page Setup dialog box appears. On the Margins tab, you can set each margin to best meet your requirements. To apply your settings and close the dialog box, click OK. You can see the result of your settings in the preview. Alternatively, you can also set the margins directly in the preview. To do this, click the Show Margins button. If you now click on one of the small square handles, you can, while holding the mouse button depressed, drag the corresponding margin into a new position. To enlarge the preview, Click the Zoom to Page button once. To restore the normal preview size, click the button again. Clicking the Show Margins button again hides the margins from view. If you are satisfied with your settings, you can start printing by clicking Print. If you like, you can click on another tab or press Escape to return to the usual worksheet view. Margins can also be set on the Page Layout tab in the Page Setup group using the Margins button. Clicking this button brings you the same margin setting options as found in the Backstage view.